been very quick with this. I would like you to please look at this statement that was given to the plain senior citizen by Lyle Thomas. And, uh, Name and Mr. Richardson. Yeah. What's the record? Name and address. Oh, Linda Urban, 254 George Avenue, Wilkes Barre. Mayor, I'd like you to have a copy because you need to know what's going on around here. <laughs> <laughs> if you will kindly take a look at the statement that I gave you, Council. As most likely learned bill payers of the city, what happens to be missing on that receipt that says $100? What word? If you were doing a business transaction with someone, what word would you look for if you paid them? If you paid them $100 in cash, what word would you expect to see on that statement? Hello? The word cash, this statement does not say cash. Where did that money go? Mayor Layton, I gave you a copy of this because lag has been the focus of criticism in this city for quite some time. A 66-year-old senior citizen who had open heart surgery called me about two weeks ago and asked me for help. He handed over $100 cash <coughs> Lag took his vehicle, and the man had his tools in the trunk. Lag told him, you give me a hundred bucks, buddy, and I'll open the trunk of your car. And the title, Linda. And the title. There's more to it. There's also a receipt here for $250, and this gentleman was told to give it to his insurance company. Well, what do you know? I think you better start talking to Lad Towing because he is dragging you right down with him. Okay, the next thing is I want to talk about um, the 67,000 gallons of gasoline that's missing in Wilkes Ferry Public Garage again. And um, I want you to know that the majority of the citizens of this city will not tolerate another tax increase. I guarantee you, and I doubt any one of you are going to get reelected because we'll make sure you don't. If you push this responsibility on the struggling families of this city, you can just pack your bags because you guys are not going to get elected again. I also want you to know the $27,000 fine from the Department of Revenue that was assessed to the city, to the city, which is basically and technically us. We are not paying that either and you are not taking it out of the general fund. You dip into your pockets, every one of you, and Mr. Layton, you were caught on camera taking gas. So therefore, you take the money out of your $80,000 a year salary, and you pay up on this 27 grand. Don't look at us to pay it. You've been playing games far too long. The people of the city have had it, have had it, with the salaries, the benefits, the pensions, <coughs> You know, you guys are on thin ice. And I guarantee you, you push a tax increase, forget about being re-elected. Thank you. Thank you.